Hello, good morning. This is Teacher Seppi. And uh, today, I'm going to discuss about laws of exponents. I, uh, I am going to discuss each law for each video para mas uh, deeper yung discussion. Okay, so yung laws of exponents, uh, usually marami siyang lumalabas, lalo na sa test sa uh, licensure exam for teachers and uh, civil service. So, ayun. Uh, I'll begin to discuss this one, this laws. And then, uh, each of these laws, and uh, I'm going to give you, uh, I'm going to discuss, I mean, like, give examples from the simplest example to the more complicated example, okay? So, ayun. I'll begin to, to discuss this one, the first law, which is x raised to n times x raised to m. Okay, so very simple law. And the application is from very simple uh, question or like concept to a very complex one. So as you can see on the board, I have here some examples and uh, very simple to complex. Ayan, so x n or x raised to n times x raised to m. Now, if the same basis, same basis which are x, okay, x yung basis natin dito, add nyo lang yung exponents. Okay? So, add nyo lang yung exponents. As simple as that. So, here, copy the base, which is x, and then add the exponents. So, n plus m. Okay? Example. x raised to 5 times x raised to 6. Copy the base, which is x. Okay? And then add the exponents. So, we have 5 plus 6. So, the answer here is x raised to 11. 5 plus 6 is, raised, uh, is equal to 11. Next one. We have x raised to 3 times y4 times x raised to 7. Now, ano yung gagawin nyo dito? Okay, so pag ganito, na may ibang variable present, aside from the x or other, like common variable, kukopyahin nyo lang yun. Yung walang, uh, walang kapareho, okay? So, ganito. x and x, okay? So, si x, dalo, uh, dalawa sila dito. So, kopyahin nyo lang si x, the base. And then, add the exponents of x. 3 plus 7. So, here. And then, wala nang, uh, wala nang kaano dito si y. So just copy it. y raised to 4. Copy that. Just copy it. And then, proceed. x raised to 3 plus 7. That's 10. Okay? And then, copy y4. That's it. That's the answer na. Okay? So, ganun lang siya. Pag uh, may kaparehong base, kopyahin yung base, add exponents. Pag walang kapareho yung base, kopyahin nyo lang siya. Okay? Next. x raised to 17 y raised to 3 times x raised to 3, y7, z3. Again, sabi ko sa inyo, same base, kopyahin nyo yung base, add exponents. Pag mayroong base na uh, variable na wala, walang kapareho, kopyahin nyo lang siya, okay? So, x, here, dalawa, 17 yung exponent ng isa, 3 yung exponent ng isa, kopyahin nyo si x, add exponent 17 plus 3, it's here. And then, mayroon din si y, dalawa sila, so, uh, kopyahin nyo lang si y, add exponents which are 3 and 7. So, we have 3 plus 7. And then, si z, nag lang siya. So, just copy it. z raised to 3. Okay? So, x, 17 plus 3, that's 20. And then, y, 3 plus 7, that is 10. And then, z, 3. Just copy it. Okay? So, this is now the simplest form of the final answer. Now, mayroon tayong complicated dito. Medyo complicated siya. 8 x raised to 4, y raised to 7, times 3, x raised to 17, y raised to 8, z raised to 3. Now, pag may coefficient na siya, numerical coefficient, when sa numerical coefficient, yun yung numbers na makikita nyo before the variables. Okay? Pag nakita yung numbers na yan, multiply nyo lang siya. Okay? So, that's, wala siyang exponent, di ba? This is 8, and then 3. So, walang exponent, hindi sila pareho. 8 and 3 are not of the same basis. Multiply nyo sila. 8 times 3, that is 24. Okay? And then si x, dalawa, x4, and then x17. Kopyahin nyo si x, add the exponents, which are 4 and 17. 4 plus 17, that is 21. And then si y naman meron, dalawa sila. Kopyahin nyo si y, add the exponents, 7 plus 8, that is 15. Since z here is nag-iisa lang siya, kopyahin nyo lang siya. Z3. So, ito yung final answer natin. Okay? Next one. 
may numerical coefficient. Pero yung numerical coefficient, may exponent and the same base. Pag hindi the same base, kopyahin nyo lang. Okay? Ngayon, 2, 7, and 2, 6. Kopyahin nyo si 2, which is the base. Huwag nyo na i-multiply kasi sobrang malaki na siya. Unless you have the calculator. Okay? So, we say 2, and then the exponent, 7 and 6. Add nyo lang yan. 7 plus 6 is 13. And then, x, dalawa siya. 8, x, uh, x, and x, 10. So, kopyahin nyo si x. 8 plus 10, that is 18. Kopyahin nyo si y, which is y8 and y6. So, that is 8 plus 6, that is 14. And then, si z, meron tayo, z, 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 z14 and z10, so that's z, and then 14 plus 10, that is 24. Ito yung final answer natin, okay? So, ganun lang po siya, pa, uh, yung first rule natin, x, the same basis, different exponents, add the basis, uh, no, copy the base, and then add exponents, that's it, okay? So, I'll be discussing the next next law on the next video. So, please don't forget to share this video sa review groups ng civil service in le uh, licensure exam for teachers. And also, don't forget to visit my YouTube channel, Teacher Seppi. And don't forget to click subscribe and ring uh, with uh, clicking the bell for its uh, notifications of future videos ko. Okay, so this is Teacher Seppi. Bye-bye.